Hi guys, my name is Michelle from YouTube channel Beauty and the Blog, and today I'm here to share with you some of the items off my Christmas wish list. So one of the first items on my Christmas wish list is a Roberto Cavalli fragrance, and I believe it's pronounced Nero Assoluto. It's in a black bottle with a gold lid. I recently went into my local drugstore and I smelt it and I fell in love. Like, I don't know what didn't what stopped me from buying it at that moment in time. Perhaps because Christmas was around the corner, but it is literally amazing. Another thing that I am lusting after is the Christian Louboutin nail polishes. I know they're they're a bit extreme. I think I'm more in love with the bottle, if anything. The neutrals from that collection caught my eye. I think there are really, really nice nudes in there, which I am in love with, and I would really, really want one of them sitting in my nail polish collection. Another thing that I would love to have is a Clarisonic face brush. With the party season coming up and the new year kicking in, I kind of want to make sure my skin is at its best. So I think a Clarisonic would be a really nice way to kind of detoxify my skin and keep me looking fresh and radiant when the new year kicks in. I never used to really be a fan of eyeshadows, but lately I have been in love with them, literally. But the only kind of shades I wear are really kind of neutral earth tones. So uh, Lime Crime's Venus palette has caught my eye. I think it's amazing and it's really pigmented. A lot of the colors are very neutral and earth tone and there's a lot of rusty kind of tones in there. So that is another thing that I am lusting after. I would love that playing around and do a few makeup looks. If you follow me on YouTube, you'll know that I am a lover of highlights and another one that I'm lusting after is the Kevin Aquan highlight in Candlelight. It literally is like candlelight on your skin. I went to my good friend's house and I tested it out and I thought it was incredible and I haven't yet got around to buying it. So that is a definite must have on my Christmas list. I feel like that would be a staple piece in my makeup collection and I definitely need it in my makeup bag before the year is out. Another thing that I've had my eye on is the Charlotte Tilbury contour and highlight palette. It looks amazing and I love a contour and a highlight. I actually cannot live without it. I feel like if I've done my makeup and I haven't contoured or I haven't highlighted, something is missing. So I definitely need that in my collection. It's just a really nice kind of contour color, which is good because it has no shimmer in it at all. And the highlight is actually looks really amazing too so it's just enough to give your face that pop without it being too extreme another thing that I would like is some new makeup brushes and I really love the rose gold collection by Zoeva I have some of their brushes already but um, the rose gold collection is just really really pretty they really look nice and the quality of their brushes are amazing as well so I would really love some new makeup brushes preferably maybe more eye makeup brushes and like tapered brushes so I can do like contoured looks as well. Another fragrance related gift that I would like is Victor and Rolf Bon Bon. I was an addict when it came to Flower Bomb, which was my signature fragrance. And I recently smelled Bon Bon and it's literally like candy. When you walk past someone, they're gonna smell you and wonder what you are wearing because it's that amazing. Probably I probably use that as maybe my everyday fragrance and I would use the Roberto Cavalli one as my nighttime fragrance. I can't get enough of nudes at the moment and um, one of the nude lipsticks that I've been looking to get is Velvet Teddy by MAC, which I cannot seem to get my hands on anywhere. So maybe I would have more luck putting on a Christmas list and having someone do the hunt for me because I don't know why I can't seem to find it anywhere. It's just a really nice peached undertoned nude, which pretty much would go with any skin tone and I think it would look amazing with the kind of bronzy makeup looks that I do. So I feel like I need it in my collection right away. And the last thing on my beauty Christmas wish list is the Amani Under Eye Concealer in Salmon. I've heard nothing but raves about this concealer and it's meant to be really good at getting rid of your dark circles. 
before you apply your foundation so i really want to try that because i literally live for panda eyes i could be a spokeswoman for having panda eyes that guys is my beauty christmas wish list i hope you enjoyed this video um feel free to check out the link below which will take you to my channel and i will see you in my next video which will be products i'll be using in january helping myself to kind of recover from the party season so i'll see you all next time bye